Chase. Happy Wednesday. Welcome back to Chats with Chase, and here's your next tip. Sometimes we forget to add or create appearances and open the blank part and visualize. Once I get this far, I don't really want to backtrack and do all that in SolidWorks, but luckily I can go ahead and create new appearances, write and visualize. To do so, just click the plus sign in the Appearances tab and select New Appearance. This will add a generic, empty appearance where you can create your own. In this case, I still want to add an image like I had in SolidWorks. I'll click on this color button and it'll prompt me for a selection. Grabbing this file and opening it, the appearance now looks like it. I'll quickly apply it to the part just by dragging it over and dropping it. Now if we want to refine this a little more, we could come in and play around with the settings. But for now, I just want to show how to save this. You'll just come up here and click the export button, select save appearance, and navigate to your appearances folder. There's a good chance that yours already defaults to the correct appearances folder location. I'll just make a new folder named custom appearances, open it, and then name and save my new appearance. You should now see the custom folder and appearance in your library. Thanks for watching. Contact me with any questions and I'll see you tomorrow.